Hello and welcome to Car Pros. Today's class will be all about engine oil. Let's jump right in. While there are many fluids in a vehicle, there is none more important than engine oil. The main function of engine oil is to reduce wear on moving parts. It also cleans, improves sealing, inhibits corrosion, and cools the engine by carrying heat away from moving parts. The Society of Automotive Engineers, or SAE, has established a numerical code system for grading engine oils according to their viscosity characteristics. Viscosity is a measure of resistance to gradual deformation by shear stress or tensile stress. So in short, high viscosity is thick and low viscosity is thin. An example is, honey has a much higher viscosity than water. The SAE viscosity gratings include the following from low to high viscosity 0, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 40, 50, or 60. The numbers 0, 5, 10, 15, and 25 are suffixed with the letter W, designating they are winter, not weight, or cold starting viscosity at lower temperature. The number 20 comes with or without a W depending on whether it's being used to denote a cold or hot viscosity grating. The SAE designation for multi-grade oil in internal combustion engines includes two viscosity grades. For example, 5W30 designates a common multi-grade oil. The first number, 5W, is the viscosity of the oil at a cold temperature, and the 30 is viscosity 100 degrees Celsius. There are two types of oil, conventional and synthetic. Conventional oil is derived from petroleum and is recommended to be changed every 3,000 miles. Synthetic oil is derived from chemicals in a lab. These oils were developed by German scientists in the early 40s due to the lack of minerals during wartime. Since synthetic oil has a lower volatility, it can last 6,000 to 8,000 miles between oil changes. The trade-off is that it's more expensive. Most modern engines recommend full synthetic oil. An oil filter is a filter designed to remove contaminants from engine oil. Oil filters are generally located near the middle or bottom of the engine. After changing the oil and oil filter, it is important to dispose of used oil properly. It is both illegal and hurtful to the environment to dump oil improperly. To dispose of used oil properly, take it to any parts dealer. So in summation, there's a couple of key points to remember. Oil is important for the engine to keep lubricated and have it running for a long time. It comes in a wide range of viscosities. It comes in two different forms, conventional and synthetic. And it's also important to replace the oil filter. And don't forget to dispose of it properly. That pretty much wraps up the oil class video. Thanks a ton for watching. Hit the subscribe button down below for more class videos that we have in the works. And we'll catch you next time.